Your mama's yapping in the backseat Tell her to push over and move them big feet Every Monday morning I gotta drive a daddy on a employment agency This morning I fight and tell her I give up Tell her she wins, she should just shut up Cause it's the last time that she's gonna be riding with me with John Zorch, and he is the organizer for the Wide Water Beach Fest, right? Correct. All right, and this is, you know, kind of the day before the preparations are underway for the big event. Um, why don't you tell us a little bit about what the Wide Water Beach Fest is and how it got started? Well, it was, uh, we moved in here in 2005. It was uh, 10 years ago, and we had a little gathering after moving in for a couple weeks, and a, a year later, my daughter wanted a band for her birthday. Mm -hmm. And where the volleyball court is today was a big pile of rubble, so we put this stage on top of the rubble. We had a band, and uh, it got a little bit big because we found out that it was on the Internet. We didn't know it. So instead of having 25 of her closest friends, she had 75 of her not-so-closest friends come by. And uh, that's how it started. We said if we're going to do this again, which we decided to do again and again, we said we'll do it for charity. Mm -hmm. uh, so the first-year charity in the first few years was for the Wounded Warrior Project. And then a few years ago, we switched to Final Salute, which helps the homeless women veterans that are uh, around the country. Unfortunately, 55,000 of them that are homeless. That is way too close. Hey, you're supposed to be my bridesmaid at my wedding. Throw that ball. You're supposed to support me. Who's got skills? Who's got skills? I'm supposed to be today. What does it mean to be able to support and help all Final Salute? Well, let me tell you first what Final Salute is. It's a nonprofit organization that helps homeless female veterans and children. So basically, that's why we are here today at Whitewater Beach Fest. That's why I'm here, to basically help support Whitewater Beach Fest and to be able to help homeless female veterans. To this day, 285 women and children have been supported because of Final Salute's mission. And that's why I'm here. I'm a female veteran. I've been in the Army 13 years. And to know that there's an estimated 55,000 homeless female veterans and their children on our soil today is dis disheartening to me. So that's why I'm here to support it. That's why I decided to compete in Miss Veteran America organization. personal circumstances as a homeless female veteran. In 2005, I was a single mother, lieutenant, and I was headed to Iraq. I never made it, however. I lost everything to Hurricane Katrina in August and received a devastating cancer diagnosis a month later. Um, that wasn't the devastating part. The hard part was being told that because I was a woman, there were no supportive services for women who had served their country. And for me, that was a very hard pill to swallow. And so because of that, I found Final Salute five years later. Oh, no. and it's all because, it's all because of you. Oh, I, I fall because I fall because of you. And finally, I'm free because I'm free because I'm free because you show me how to love, love, love. It's, it's, it's a really good charity. I mean, they take, there's... The homeless female veterans, they're raising money for, hopefully give them a better life because they fought for our country, so it's kind of unfair that they're being like left behind.